Hello everyone, it's Dronlina here and welcome back to House Flipper. So we did uh, those uh, awful quests last time, so well quests. Uh, we quest more uh, where we had first to paint uh, someone's living room wall. That uh, adventurous amaranth and next a nursery, which had to be uh, painted pastel pink, but not just one wall, not just two walls. All of the four walls had to be painted pastel pink. It was not something that I really enjoyed looking at in any way, shape or form. So now let's have a look at the other emails that we have. Uh, additional walls was knocked down and student house to clean up. Let's start off with additional walls. Sounds fine. Good afternoon, I need some alterations made to my tomb bedroom her house. My daughter is now three and we need to feel it's time that she has her own room. Please divide the bedroom into two rooms and make sure that the new rooms both have doors that connect to the corridor. Could you please also have put a new bed and, did, and remove the crib? Yours faithfully. Thomas Johnson. No problem at all. I think that would be fine. I think this is uh, how the room, uh, the, how their house is looking at the moment. Um, let me have a quick look. This is a, a room closet. All right. And this is the, um, the bedroom. What we're talking about. Some interesting red stripes, I have to admit. Um, so yeah, they already... Uh, give me an idea of where to destroy walls and where to place them, which I don't like personally because I'd like to, uh, yeah, to, to use my own imagination uh, where I want stuff to be. But first of all, let's start off with demolition. This is going to take a while, I think. Let's just break a couple of wall sections. Hmm, seems to be breaking down but not falling to the ground, unfortunately. Hmm, let's make sure that at the bottom here everything, everything is gone as well. Hmm, it seems to be holding together rather well, unfortunately. I hope that the wall was... The wall would come crashing down on me. The moment I use my sledgehammer on it, but it doesn't seem to be the case. Let's break all the lower pieces of this wall. Because if there isn't a support on the bottom anymore, it should all just fall down. Hmm. There we go. This is mo looking more like it. Please come down, everyone. Hmm. Oh, I got a new skill point. But, well, let's first make sure this whole wall is gone, because I'd rather not be distracted and ending up seeing nothing. There are some pieces left over here, but everything seems to be fine right now. Let's have a look at the skill points. We've got demolition. Um, either 25 fast demolition, 5% more muscle strength, or an upgraded hammer. Uh, let's go with the passionate hammer master perk, which means 75% faster demolition. For now, we can build walls. We can now build intels as well, which are those half walls, I think. Hmm probably have to plaster these walls as well. No, am I... Oh, I'm one way off. Really? Oh, well, let's all come down again. Why would you build a wall immediately next to the point where you want to open the door? That seems so wrong. Every time you want to open the door, you're just hitting the wall with the door. The, this one, right? Hmm. Oh. oh, you go there. I really hope we do get another skill point in, uh, or do get a skill point in building soon because this is going to take ages. Oh, yes, we got a skill point. Uh, faster building, the build was already painted. Let's go for this one. I don't care that it's uh, taking me a bit longer, but having an already painted wall. Is a good place to start. And uh, let's make sure we're with this one. Like here. No, you didn't finish. No, there we go. The last thing I want is have Yes, having to build a the last segment of wall right in that corner. 
And this is going much better. There we go. Everything has been built. We now just have to paint. Um, what kind of paint do we want on the walls? Let's first choose a bed. Uh, we can sell the crib first because she doesn't need the crib anymore. Uh, let's find a nice bed for her. Um, we don't want a bunk bed. That's a bit odd. But a nice children's bed would be nice. They got bunk beds. By, uh, bunk beds. Uh, they, they, they actually got those. So I'm really surprised because they didn't have that before. And this Italian lover bed. An infatuation bed. Wow. Hmm. I love this bed. But I think it's a bit big. Hmm. We got this bed, which is looking nice. Ooh, they got more options again. Uh, we do know that the de uh, dresser they have is, I think, this color. Ooh, let's choose a... This is nice. Like, like this, yeah? Hmm. But now let's place it here. Because I want to move these things. Because I want a better play play place there. And I think I uh, I bought a different style of uh, wood in the bed compared to the dresser. But well... Um, really, these shelves are causing a problem. Hmm. Oh no, I don't think it were the shelves necessarily. It's more the radiator. But that's fine. We fixed it. There we go. And there you got your chair. Let's turn it around a bit. Like this. Hmm. And let's pick you up. I'd rather have you on this wall. Are you fresh? Yes, you are. Let's place you on the bed. That's an adorable bunny. And these things. Oh, it's really odd to place it there. Hmm. You on top of there. You like here, and lastly, let's place you up there. Like a nice, uh, th th those blocks are laying there perfectly fine. Um, let's move you on there, and it is looking way better. She doesn't have any curtains. How can you not have curtains in a child's room? Mind about just curtain. Hmm. I need a short, narrow curtain, like this one. Uh, she does have all kinds of... Hmm... It looks just old. Is this set of flowers? Oh, the shells are in the way, I think. Let's place those there. Issue in here. I don't want to leave this room without putting up some proper curtains. This girl's gonna have a new bedroom. Like her own proper bedroom. But she doesn't have any curtains. That's just horrible. Don't they look nice? They are a bit white though. Hmm. Let's move this table around as well. Hmm. What's the best way to place this? Like, should I pull the dress all the way over here? Like, get it over here. The bed can, like, be like this somewhere. The, these things in, are in the way. Oh, what did I do? Oh, to its previous position, but the previous position is gone. Well, sure, I guess. I know I need to paint out the wall. Don't worry, guys. I know I have to do it. It's just... I'd rather first start decorating... Properly decorating the room instead of... Well, what it used to be. Uh, those shells are annoying. Oh, I can just pick them up. Hallelujah. Um, let's put them here. Oh. Well, shoot. Those... Fluffy things are going to fall. I am sorry about your horse and your cat. I... Mm, did I 
anything else full, please? Oh, no. Well, at least I can pick up most of the stuff without a problem. Uh, you're going to be on here as well. And let's grab another bunny. And put that over here. And the last... Oh, the just three. <laughs> never mind. Never mind. I thought this was going to be an easy job. Like, quickly break down some walls, build up some other walls. I don't see a problem. Well, well, guys, you don't know me yet. I am like... I don't want to do half a job. I want to do a proper job. And a proper job means not just doing what is said to be done. If you know you're going to make a child's bedroom, you're going to make sure it's a proper bedroom. Which means you're going to make sure she has some curtains. Why don't you want to play placed here? Like, like here. Make sure you're not... Like this? It's a bit... a big gap over here. Hmm. Like this? Yeah, this is looking fine. And let's move this chair. Like this. And then she got like way more space. I need a... Oh, I can put a poof in there. Um, well, let's first buy this one as well. Because I want to hang it here. And we're going to paint that wall a color. Because having four white walls is just... Unthinkable. I know there are people who love like, white walls. And don't get me wrong. Some white walls... Are really nice from time to time but not for a kid's bedroom they are supposed to have fun um let's get a poof like a, a colored poof hmm not really the like the bright colored ones no yeah, i'm not looking for either like but you do have boring colors yes are like we can do like the, the regular one and then use like violet. Yeah, let's place it over here. It's got a place to sit, to read. Let's place the bunny back on her bed. Like this. And now we just have to pick a wall color. Um, walls. Oh, we can. We don't have a plaza, I think. We can do some wall panels. Are they like really nice? No, not really paint um we can do a pink let's quickly have a look at the room but also i'm really tempted to like a lilac like a purple white lavender hmm. are these all the options let's go for bright lavender then um uh, paint and let's make sure this wall is painted here a bit brighter than I thought it would be, but well, it's not nice. It is it's way better than the pink in the nursery, and especially better than the amaranth in the living room <laughs> last episode. Hmm. Uh, let's grab you. Uh, oh. let's do you. Um, I do. I want this piece over here purple as well. Let's do this piece over here purple as well because I want to get rid of that red stripe over there and otherwise I have to buy another paint which also isn't a really big problem but it's just well like this oh this as well as well like two walls yeah let's do that like not really like one color but we could make the window seals like the um, like I don't know what they call but like these inner walls Let's try to make these purple as well. Like a little fun purple accent on the windows. Like you. And then you. Isn't this doesn't this look nice? I like it. And that's all it counts at the moment, because I'll be the one renovating this room. A little wink of purple near the windows. It also is really matchy matchy with the curtains. Like this. I think this looks nice. We got the kids room done. Yeah, 
this is looking proper. This is like a proper kid's room. Yeah, I like it. It's much... <gasps> we need something on the walls. No, wait a moment. We cannot do without some accessories, some... Looks been... Is it not, nothing like decoration? Oh, it's decorations. Pictures and paintings. Hmm. I don't have my... Uh, any of my own stuff uploaded yet, so I have to do with all these in-game paintings. So There's quite a lot, but there is nothing for kids. I don't have a tab like kids or like other. Well, oh, that's f all kinds of stuff, but nothing for children, I think. Like children, chair, bed, foam bridge, and cube. Like. Kids. Oh, no, that's it. A purple block pyramid? Really? You don't have any accessories. Like, no paintings for children. Um, well. Let's buy this and then the blue square, I think. At least let's hang something on the walls. You know what? Let's move it to what's here. That's a bit better. That we don't have like the, these blend walls. Uh, we do have the parents' room here, which also needs a bit of paint. Hmm. Do we want to make a, a different color in here? Yeah, make the bed. Hmm. It is a bit bland here, but what kind of color? Because I don't want to use lilac again. We could have like this... Make this a light grey all the way around and like a very dark purple. Is there like a dark purple in here? Hmm. Wolves. Like paint? Hmm. I think like purple quartz is like the, the darkest purple they have. But it still looks a bit, you know, lilac y. Uh, it's better. It's it's better. It's, it's way brighter than I'd hoped. I'd more hoped like almost a navy bluish purple, if you understand what I mean. Like that kind of intensity, that kind of darkness. But th th this will do, I guess. And then I will get a light grey for the other walls. Hmm, maybe should I should have made this a navy blue after all. Yeah, purple isn't the colour to go here. Uh... Sell you. Let's go for navy blue. This is like the color I wanted, but in purple. But I didn't have that. So that's a shame. At least I know what I want. And this was available, this color at least. I'm really happy they do have some lighter colors and some darker colors. They do have some really odd mid range colors, which I really don't understand. I mean, I, I understand why they, un unlike what most people use in the... Oh crap, I didn't want a dark. But I do like this color though. So I should remember that navy blue is actually a nice color to put on the balls. But as I was saying, like... At least I, I know it's here for me. I know that loads of people put like uh, different shades, shades of uh, brown, of grey, of like neutral colors. They put all different kinds of, of neutral colors on the walls. But I don't see as many neutral colors here in this game. And I do see some awfully loud um, and bright colors, which I think I have never seen in an actual home. Like, another home here in House Flipper, just an actual home. But, well, that could just be me. I mean, I, I don't know how it's for other countries or, or like, other... Maybe other cultures? I don't know. But here in the Netherlands, and, and, and yeah, I, I haven't seen any bright colors on walls. The only thing I've seen is like white, eggshells, beige, brown, white, just a regular white, creamy white. I mean, I do have in my own home like a creamy white on the walls, but that's just because it was the easiest painting to get. I mean, I, I went to like, oh, I got a skill point. Um, faster painting. Let's go for one in each category. 
Uh, but as I was saying, I went to like this very cheap stall and I went there to, uh, searching for paint because we didn't have a whole lot of money to buy paint, like removing. We've got other stuff to buy than paint. But we still wanted to paint the walls because some of the walls were looking awful and we didn't want like paint one ball. And still having having this really weird color differences between all the walls. So we thought, well, just paint both of the rooms and be done with it. Um, but still, that was like white and a creamy white. And those were your options. Like, there, there wasn't a whole lot of color. And as far as I know, like that, that uh, together with some variants of gray and brown is what people put on the walls here. And this game has like 20 different shades of extremely bright stuff that I have never seen on a wall in my life. Like, it's even too bright for clothing. At least that that's what I think. Um, yeah, everything's painted. Nice. Uh, let's sell these. Uh, but let me quickly show you because, I mean, I'm ranting about the co the, the color choice. I mean, these are all great, like gray based, like a cacao, steel gray, light biscuit, natural based, dirty pink. But then you get to hear like, what the actual? No one is going to put alluring lavender or sunny yellow or ripe pear. Ripe pear is just neon green. It's just a fancy way of saying neon green. Emirates Adventure is such a color as well. Like pistachio green, ice blue, which isn't ice blue at all because ice blue is supposed to be like a silvery white, very light blue, but not like turquoise. I mean, I'm sorry guys <laughs> that I'm ranting about color choice in a, in a game. It's just, it, it, it feels so wrong to me. Uh, I have to add some devices and there is something broken in here. Um, hello? Can I... That range hood is real annoying. I'm temporarily moving all plant. Um, all right, let's remove this. But yeah, I, I mean, I don't know whether the selection of paints has changed since uh, since I've played it last. I mean, I've played it last like I think it's almost a year ago, like the beginning of, oh, oh, oh yeah, the beginning of. Um, 2019 was the last time I think I played uh, House Flipper. So I don't know whether there have some, been some big updates that added lots of content. But because I can remember it was even worse last time I played it. Uh, because, uh, considering the paint choices. I mean, like it, sometimes it felt like the only option you had were incredibly bright paints. And that's it. Well, let's leave it here, you know? Not my problem at the moment. This is done. Mount devices. What the hell needs to be mounted? Uh, in that corner. Oh, there's another broken wall socket. Didn't see that. Well, let's remove this. But I do love, by the way, they added loads more furniture because you used to have like these uh, cabinet modules for in the kitchen. But you now you got so many more options and there used to be like two options for bathroom sinks and that's it. You got like this very small mountable sink on the wall without a cabinet and you got a, that green minty green cabinet that did it and like the expensive one and those three were your options. There was no fourth or fifth option. So you had like a cheap AF washing basin on the wall. Or you had like a country looking cabinet or you had like an expensive cabinet that didn't fit in most interiors either so it, it was a bit of a hassle but i'm so glad they updated um those things and or added more content but for now we up, we have done 100 percent of this order we earned four thousand two hundred uh two hundred and seven dollars and 46 cents so yes we do want to complete the order um let me have a quick look at the time. I think I'm going to take a small break. This has been quite a um, long request, or at least it has been a short request, but I made it. I made it much more difficult than it actually is supposed to be. So for now, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring the notification bell if you want to get updated every time I post a new video. If you got tips and tricks for here at House Flipper 
Oh, which I haven't mentioned this episode yet, but at a certain point I'm going to buy houses here. And I want to have either a challenge or a uh, goal to make a house a certain in a certain style or I have to do of, just think of things I could do because I can just make each house like as, as beautiful as I can but I would like to know what you guys want to see as well so leave that in the comment section down below have an awesome day and I see you guys next time